Okay, this is just a short video on how to turn on the exam 2500 air monitor, how to do a fresh air cow with it, and then how to turn it back off. So it's real easy to turn on. You've got a green button there to your right. You just push on that green button and hold it. And you're going to do have a countdown and that little noise. When you hear that little beep noise, you just let go of it. That's how many days left you have calibration, 102. So if you're concerned about that, just make sure you look at that when you first turn it on. Now it's just going to go through all the sensor settings and everything, and then the numbers are going to pop up that you would uh, use right there. So you've got a 0, 20.9, and a minus 5, and a 0, 0.0. So everything looks good, except this should be 0. And what you would do normally is let it warm up. Right now it's cold, so if you try to do a fresh air cow, you'll see what what you're going to get. Is you're going to get this uh, this uh, timer saying that it's um, it's not warmed up enough for a fresh air cow. So anyway, what you would do for a fresh air cow is push this blue button right here three times: one, two, three. And then you can see right there, this is for a fresh air cow, this little fan icon. So that's what you want, fresh air cow. So then you would push the OK button, the green button. Push that once and see now I get two minutes. That means I have two minutes left for this to warm up before I can actually perform a fresh air cow. So this one is cold and it's warming up and I've got two minutes. So just to speed it up, I've got one over here that's been on for a while and it's already warmed up. So with this one, I'm gonna go ahead and do the fresh air cow. So you push it three times. Okay, you get the fresh air cow symbol. Push the green button once. Okay, now what you get is it's going through the system to do a fresh air cow. So you push the green button once. Now you're gonna push it one more time. Now it says everything's okay. I'll just leave it alone. And you get that cow symbol. Now you can just leave it and eventually it'll go back to the uh, to the beginning of it, to where all the numbers are. Or you can push this blue button here and it'll just immediately go right back. But you see everything is zeroed. 0, 20.9, 0, 0.0, and 0. That's how you want it. Everything should be zero except for the O2 should be 20.9. But basically, that's it for Fresh Air Cow. I can walk you through it one more time. That's all it is, is just pushing this blue button three times. One, two, three. Then you get that Fresh Air Cow symbol. Push the green button once. Then I usually give it like five flashes or five seconds just for it to do its Fresh Air Cow on itself. And then go ahead and push the green button one more time. And you get all OKs, which means everything's good. And then you're going to get that symbol. And like I said, you can just wait. You know, I don't know if it's 30 seconds or so. And eventually it'll pop back to the front that you're using, the user part of it. Or you can just push the blue button here. And it just automatically goes back to the very beginning where you use it at. So that's the Fresh Air Cow. <clears throat> and I can just take a look at this one real quick. I don't think this one's ready yet, but I'll try it. One, two, three. Okay, this one's warmed up now, so I can do the fresh air cow, so you can see how the numbers change on it. Now I'll push the green button, give it about five flashes. And you see we did have a minus four there. Now it's doing the fresh air cow. Push the green button again, and everything says it's okay. Now you can see it's a zero. But I'm going to go ahead and push the blue button after that. And you can see everything's zeroed now. It's all good to go. You're ready to use it. And that's it. Now when you're ready to shut it down, you have to hold the blue and the green button together. Push them both down and hold it down. Now it's a little hard to do with... There we go. And it does a countdown. And then once it makes that noise, you just let it go. And it's turned off. I'll do that again with this one. Hold the blue and the green button down together. Does a countdown. Makes that noise. You just let go of the buttons. And that's it. Turns itself off. 
So nothing hard about it. That's it.